Five Minute Eats. Five Minute Eats. Five Minute Eats. Hey guys, welcome back to Five, Five Minute, minute Eats. Eats. Today we have a snacking item, and this is Cheez It Snapped. So they're kind of like little chips. We'll pop it up here so that you can see it. We have two flavor varieties. We've got cheddar, sour cream, and onion. And then we have double cheese. And I do not like Cheez-Its, so I'm not looking forward to it. Wow, really? Yeah, well, I'm not a cheese, I'm not like a cheese person like you. Like, wow, you're, you're, <laughs> cheese person? Yeah, you're very into, like, everything it's got to have cheese on it. <laughs> well, it's funny because I he went to Sam's earlier today and I told him, get just some like snack, you know? And so then he's showing like what they have. And I was like, get a cheese it You know, I figured that you liked Cheez-Its also. No. Wow. When was the, when 15 you... years together and I did not know that he didn't like yeah. cheese. Well, when have you ever seen me eat a cheese it <laughs> Well, to be fair, whenever we were in the truck and I would buy Cheez-Its, Somehow the box would go empty without me eating all of it. So I, I mean, no. somebody was eating the cheeses. I, I don't like cheeses. I don't eat it. So anyway, <laughs> maybe what do in we a have moment here? of desperation. Yeah, could be. So this is cheesy, thin, and crispy. Like I said, I think it's kind of their version of like a chip almost, um, but still cracker. And um, I hope that they're good because we have a case of them. <laughs> so yeah. So let's hope. Um, I guess we'll try the standard first, the double cheese. All right. That way we have a clean palette to try the other one. You know who's a big fan of cheese? It's Dave Portnoy. Oh, re oh yeah, yep. that's right, that's right. From um, Barstool Sports. Yeah, this is probably really loud because my mic is right here. Yeah. You guys got an earful with that one. Oh. They smell pretty cheesy. Now my main issue with a cheese it I tend to go for the white ones because they have more cheese dust on them. I also like the one that the duos that have like pepper jack and something else in it. Um, but standard cheese it has almost no cheese dust on it, and that's my main issue. I feel like anytime you're gonna have some sort of cracker like this, it needs to have visible cheese dust. And I'm talking like cheese dust that leaves your fingers cheesy. So that's my main issue with cheese it. There's just not enough cheese dust. You know what I really hate? Uh, what? Cheese puffs. Oh, yeah. They come in those big containers. Those are like, like terrible. <laughs> I hate those. Those are things. the devil's styrofoam. When I, when I see them at the grocery store, I, I have like disgust. Like total disgust. <laughs> Who's eating those? Well, Costco and Sam's both sell like the big jars of it. So yeah. it's a very popular item. I don't know why though. Mm. Wow. Now, whenever I put that on my tongue, definite cheese dust on there. Yeah, and I was gonna say, very cheesy. Very cheesy. It is. I like that it's crispy. I, that's what I was gonna say. I like the crispiness of this. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's cheesy. Yeah. I wonder if they'll be able to see this. There's definite visible cheese dust on there though. And this tastes like a Lay's cheddar and sour cream chip. Even though this one is supposed to be cheddar, sour cream, and onion, this tastes like the cheddar sour cream chips. Mmm. Mm-hmm. These are good. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, I like them too. It has, the cheese in it is actually white cheddar cheese. And then contains 2% or less of actual cheddar cheese. So that's interesting. They're orange, but they have more yep. white cheddar cheese than the other. So, what's your verdict on the double cheese? Um. Like, like if not to buy a case again, but if we were to just buy like a single bag in Walmart or something, would you go for this flavor or the snapped in general? You know, this is a tough one for me because like I said, I don't like Cheez-Its, mm -hmm. but I think a lot of people will like this. Mm -hmm. So question is, would I buy this again? <clears throat> yeah, would you? Thumbs down on that. Really? But I think all you guys will love this. I'm just not a cheese person, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, I love it. Cheese on my pizza, on my sandwiches, et cetera, et cetera. Mm -hmm. But cheese snacks, 
Not my thing, but I think you'll love it. For me, I would definitely repurchase the double cheese for sure. All right, guys. So now we're gonna try the cheddar. This one smells sour like cream. plastic. Yeah, I was gonna say this one. I don't like the smell of it because the, the double cheese was good. Yeah, this smells like cheese. This smells like plastic. It actually just tastes like sour cream, like nothing else. It just tastes like just sour cream, like crunchy sour cream. Thumbs down. Do not like it. Like you said, it's very sour creamy. Mm -hmm. um, other than that, it has no, um, like no flavor. Flavor, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like the flavor is literally just sour cream. Like I don't even really taste cheese or onion. Not to say that it's necessarily bad because I do like sour cream, but I mean, this is no competition. Like, I mean, this one is like, if you have to eat it, you'll eat it because it's not terrible. Like, but this is the real hero. You can taste the cheese, but the sour cream is so overpowering. Yeah, it, like and is weird. You know how when you eat something, you can like taste like, you know, sour cream, and then you're like, okay, that's gone. Mm -hmm. I can taste this now that's in it. Mm -hmm. or, and then after that, whatever the third thing is, you can, you know what I mean? Yeah. This is like, just, just sour, cream. sour cream just lingers and lingers, and you're like, okay, go away, sour cream. <laughs> Where's the onion? Where's the cheese? You yeah, because I feel like with a sour cream and onion chip, I taste the onion more than I taste the sour cream. Yeah. Whereas this, like, they've really cornered the market on sour cream flavor here. Yeah, so for me, on the sour cream, cheese, onion, thumbs down. Thumbs down for me also, but I would definitely have um, the double cheese. And I do think that if you are a cheese it fan or if you just like cheesy things, the cheese it snapped in general is a good bet because <laughs> I like the texture of it. So here's the dilemma, right? Hmm. Now we have like a box of... Uh, oh, I'm still going to eat them. Well, I was good. Well, my dilemma is this. Does that mean... Um, the raccoons and opossums and stuff will eat some of this stuff and help speed up like the the you know the sour cream one at least. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Yeah. Do they? You know, if we don't like, you don't like it as much. You know, thumbs down from you. Mm-hmm. To the to the you know because remember the veggie uh, slider from oh the White yeah Castle, they didn't eat that the animals did not want it. Yeah. Know? Yeah, that was so, bad. We had to end up going out there and throwing it away after like two days because no it, one would eat it. <laughs> if the, yeah, if the trash panda does not want it. Yeah. Um, what do we do? So, um, we, I mean. I think that they'll probably eat it. Yeah, I think. You know. Well. We discovered that they actually go wild for French fries. Yeah, dude, it was um, interesting. So if you don't know, mm -hmm. we do have a channel, another YouTube channel, um, where we feed our like um, animals that come by our house every night mm -hmm. and we feed birds and raccoons and uh, you know uh, squirrels mm -hmm. chipmunks um, and the the variety of birds we get is very amazing mm -hmm. because it's like birds you now you would never expect even um was that about a month a month ago we had an owl oh, yeah. in our yard mm -hmm. and we've had hawks um, we've had like blue jays oh, but yeah. it's very fascinating so at night we put out food for our little furry animals like uh, the opossum, the skunk, and the raccoons. Mm -hmm. And it's very cute because there's a raccoon couple that comes every night. And yeah. I think the male has a, a messed up leg. Mm -hmm. So they kind of like are very uh, lovey with each other and they cuddle and mm -hmm. they lay on this uh, dog uh, cot that we have out there. And they kind of like lay there all night and then they yeah. eat. And they then graze. They, yeah. They eat, they go back to bed, mm -hmm. eat, go back to bed, and they do this until five in the morning. And the interesting th thing about the raccoons is they they don't mind sharing with the, the skunk or the possum. But yeah. for whatever reason, they have another raccoon they do not get along with. Yeah. We've actually woken up in the middle of the night, <laughs> watched them, like, uh, fighting each other. <laughs> yeah. And I mean, like, fighting. They, like, uh, are pretty ingenious, man. Yeah. There uh, was an ambush. It was an ambush. Exactly. <laughs> no, I just was could not believe how intelligent these guys were with mm -hmm. like their strategy. Yeah. Um but it's 
Gonna be interesting because now that summer's here. Oh yeah. We might have like an army of raccoons showing up. I hope so. But in the meantime, subscribe, keep watching our videos. We really, really appreciate all of you guys. And uh, let us know what you want us to try next because we yeah. definitely are open to suggestions, mm -hmm. right? Yep, definitely. So let us know. This episode of Five, Five Minute, Minute Eats. Eats. Bye.